All right, so I'm gonna be honest with you. Before I even react to this whole trailer, I literally got the notification of Shaq being in Fortnite while I was on my walk, like earlier this morning. So let's get right to it, man. <laughs> Hello? Oh yeah, that's coming down. That thing is coming down. This man is falling through the entire building? Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> the diesel. We got Shaq in Fortnite. I don't know if this is coming through. I mean, maybe this is coming through like next update, or maybe there will just be like an update added, uh, like added just anywhere, or whatever. And we got Shaq coming in uh, for Fortnite, <laughs> which, is, <laughs> which is crazy because, bro, bro, like, bro, you gotta remember, like, and I give all the credit to Shaq because at the end of the day, bro, for him to still be. Like, for him to still be in the talks of, like, everybody, for, for him to still be an inspiration to, like, you know, many kids growing up, to many basketball players, you know, coming up and stuff like that, for him to still be relevant. Uh, and I'm not saying that, like, you know, like, if you're irrelevant, then something's wrong with you. No. But for him to even be in, like, the conversation for, bro, like, what, bro, he was going off in, like, the 90s. And, bro, we're in 2024, bro. So that's what, like... That's like 30 plus years of you just being in the spotlight, you know, and for you to maintain that, that bro, it, it, that's a hard thing to do. I know, bro, a lot of people, a lot of musicians, a lot of basketball players, a lot of football players can't do that. Um, and I'm not, you know, faulting them. I'm not saying that that's like pitiful or whatever. Like, no, everybody has like their own spotlight and everybody, you know, can choose whether they want to be in that spotlight or not. But to have somebody, you know, as big as Shaq, you know, literally, um, still be in the spotlight for 30 plus years, bro. That's a hard thing to do. And um, actually on Instagram, I think I, um, I follow his, um, obviously like I follow like his Shaq account. You know, I, bro, I like, bro, I've been knowing Shaq since I was little, bro. So uh, I follow his Shaq account. Um, and then I, bro, I follow his, uh, his DJ account, bro. If you guys don't know, he actually does DJ. Um, bro, he be having like these crazy crowds or whatever. I don't know if, if that's like, I don't know if he's like the headliner or whatever, but, um, I actually recently got into DJ probably like what, two to three years ago. Um, not nothing too serious, but whatever, but like, like sometimes I'll go on YouTube and I'll like, you know, look up like, you know, and listen, call me cringe or whatever, but sometimes I'll look up like, you know, like Drake DJ sets. Like I'll look at some people cause like Drake's my favorite artist. So I'll look at people like, um, I'll look at people like DJ a bunch of like Drake songs and like mix them up and like you know do like do a bunch of like uh like uh drops and stuff like with drake songs and like it, it'll be crazy so um and so i really got into dj like I, i've really been interested in, in dj for like you know some time now not anything too heavy i'm not really into like really doing it i just like it you know just to like it. it's like it's like a hobby or whatever or it's like an interest basically um and so you know to have you know shack venture off into like a lot of these different things as well as dj you know he's in like he's kind of i mean technically he's in the music scene technically uh i think he has like a couple songs as well i think he made like a couple songs like back in the day so um you know to have Shaq, you know still pumping still going crazy um for 30 years strong bro like that's that's incredible bro like and you know but listen you know we gotta clap it up for Shaq, and then the boys in fortnite which is also i mean Shaq, bro, he's a really smart businessman as well, you know, which is a really smart business move because, you know, now, bro, Fortnite is the, I mean, I'm, I don't want to say Fortnite's the new wave. Fortnite been the wave, but, like, you know, Fortnite is obviously, like, the, one of the most popular games out there, you know, as of right now. And, you know, to have, for, and to have like, your name in Fortnite, bro, like, forever, that will be absolutely ridiculous. So, again, shout out to Shaquille O'Neal. It was crazy because, like I said before, the, at the beginning of the video, bro, like, when I was on my walk earlier, I got the notification that Shaq, it says like uh, Shaquille O'Neal in Fortnite. I'm like, wait, what? Like, what is this? Um, and I actually did hear a rumor about that, but I was like, it's a rumor. You know, I don't know about it, but then it turns out the rumor was true. You know, Shaquille O'Neal in Fortnite, which also gives me like the, it, it gives me like the imagination to think, hmm, 
what are some other people that can you know be featured in Fortnite? You know, um, for me, I would love a Fortnite put. I would love if Fortnite put a lot of of a lot of its content creators in a game. Obviously, Nick A Thirty. I was so happy of him getting it because, bro, that man deserves it, bro. I was like, bro, if anybody deserves a skin, it has to be Nick A Thirty. Like, why not? Like, for the guy who plays Fortnite all day, every day. Um, I was also thinking. Uh, I mean, Cipher got his as well. I was also thinking Courage. If Courage can get like his own skin in Fortnite, I think uh, Courage made the switch from Call of Duty to Fortnite. Like, was it like two years ago? I think. I think he went just mainly Fortnite. Uh, no, he'd been playing Fortnite, but I think like on his main channel, I think he made that switch of just like just playing Fortnite, just like just I, I think like I don't think he enjoyed Call of Duty. I think that's why he dropped it or whatever. But other than that, man, it, it's crazy seeing um, you know all these content creators and you know we got basketball players, uh, WWE wrestlers, and Dragon Ball characters and all other sorts of characters into the game. We got uh, musicians in the character. Uh, I said musicians in the characters, musicians uh, in the game as well. So. Other than that, comment down below, man. What do you, bro? What character or you know, what athlete, what uh, anime character, what whatever would you want to be in Fortnite, um, bro? We gotta have, you know what? I think <sighs> they pretty much put a lot. Of, they put a, a bit, they put a lot of people. Uh, <laughs> they put a lot of good people in the game already. Yo, they gotta put. Is the Undertaker in the game? They kind of got to put the Undertaker in the game. Or, or, see, see, you know what? If they were smart, right? What if, like, Fortnite and WWE had, like, some type of collaboration? That would be, that would be, bro, that would be crazy. Or, they could put, like, a Warhammer character in Fortnite. But I think the Warhammer character would be, like, too overpowered, I think. Um, I don't know, man. There's, there's a lot of different characters out there whenever it comes to different forms of media. So, we'll see how it is. Make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And...